Let's see the zoom on here. Sure. No, let's not zoom <laughs> thing. <laughs> You're gonna draw me like one of your French girls, Jack. <laughs> 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 Did you hear what Dave just said? He wanted me to smash. This lighting is horrible, by the way, but he wanted me to smash my new, my new vlogging camera before he smashes his. Oh my god, these shades suck. Good morning guys, um, welcome to a day in my life. I'm about to go to the gym, I'm very tired. Um, it's actually my first day at the gym in five years, so I'm also very nervous. I will bring my, my phone in there, but I'm tired. Get yourself to the So look what Ollie did to the rug. I get that he's a cat, so I knew this was gonna happen, um, which is why today we have to go to Staples. I wanna get a tape that kind of covers the corner of the rugs because he doesn't seem to be messing with anything else on the rug except the corners. So if I cover the corners with tape, and I also have, um, I ordered some rug on rug stickers. So I can place down so that kind of limits him from messing with the rug and maybe he'll find something else to mess with. But anyways, we have a staples run because I need to get some tape. I'm definitely nervous about going to the gym because I'm like there's a guy that signed me up that was very enthusiastic is he gonna be there um Oh wow, so I successfully completed my first day. Now I wanted to do an hour, I did 30 minutes. Oh my god, the lighting in here. Oh. Luckily for me, I start work at 10. Sometimes that's a good thing, sometimes that's a bad thing because I mean, I get off at 6.30, so that's kind of late. But at the same time, I'm able to get so much stuff done in the morning. I can set up a doctor's appointment at 8 o'clock. I can go to Staples and get tape. So. I forgot my wallet. And I am back home. I don't know what we should call this place. You know how people have, like, the village, La Casa? Um, I'm not really sure what to call this place, but... I really am happy about these chair seats. Guys, we are getting a neon sign that's gonna come in a million years through the mail, and it's gonna say, build the life you love. So, I can't wait. I and we can change place. the neon signs. I know what, you call this place. what should we call this place? The Mojo Dojo Casa House. No, yeah. 
the Mojo Dojo Casa House? No. Dave, let's actually have a meaningful with it. That's not meaningful. It's I don't know what. Movie yeah, don't care about the Barbie movie. Sorry, guys. I love the Barbie. Like, I like. It was an event. It was a terrible movie, but it was an event. <laughs> Ollie recently got insurance, and his middle name is Lucifer. <laughs> but honestly, he's like not the nicest cat. Unless you have food or he thinks you can like you That's can not. he can benefit from you in some way It's just true the next door neighbors. They give him food all the time <laughs> He's like he's like he rolls over instantly because he thinks he's gonna get food from them <laughs> And he usually does so okay, so drum roll the name of the apartment drum roll, please <laughs> The Haven. The Haven. <laughs> I like the Haven. Mm. Welcome you know to what? All Haven. Yes, Ollie. Come get shelter. Welcome oh, to the Haven. Happy. Welcome to Ollie. Our haven. You're at the Haven. You're at the Haven, Ollie. He says it's horrific. See, this is why his middle name is Lucifer. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, look at him. He's, what are you talking about? He's happy. <laughs> no, he's not. Yeah, look how happy he is. He's a cute little cat. Ollie Lucifer. <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> I'm a dog person, if you can't tell. but Very much. Call him like you usually call him. Ollie. No, not that one. Ollie. Not that one. Lucifer? No, no, no. That's the name, but the way you call him. How do I call him? You t you call him in a completely different tone. You don't call him differently than that. Ollie? Keep going. You're going deeper. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Ollie. Like uh, that? No. <laughs> Ollie. Ollie. You don't do that? No, because you told me if I do it, I'll tell he'll listen more. Uh, yeah, I know, but you, when you do that, it's hysterical. It makes me laugh. Is... He told me if I call Ollie like this, Ollie, Ollie. <laughs> if I do it like this, <laughs> he told me. <laughs> <laughs> it's my favorite thing in the world. He told me, he told me if I did it. She's walking around going, Ollie. <laughs> Oh, oh. He told me, I, I now, told I'm gonna, use now I'm not going to do it anymore. Now I'm not no, going to do it anymore. Because the only stop. reason why I did it because he told me that if I have a strong alto <laughs> voice that Ollie would listen to me. Why would I? I don't like... Why would I? So usually when Dave goes to work, I usually spend this time, like 30 minutes or so. I'll call my mom or I'll call whoever I need to call back, but I am currently talking to my mom. We're really not talking about much, just my job and how I'm question questioning things. I don't know. Okay, so right now this is the aesthetic I have going on for my desk. Um, I really do love the keyboard, the mouse of course. Um, I even love this little click right here, like ASMR. You know, love it. Um, and then this cute little toaster, giving you a desk tour. <laughs> I really need to get to work, but um, I just wanted to show you guys, like this is what makes me happy when I sit down and get situated. It's very important, in my opinion, don't believe what people say. It's very important to have things on your desk, in my opinion, that are things that make you happy. I love all these cute little desk accessories. Um, and what I'm also gonna add is this thing. Now, I'm probably gonna add it later, but I just wanna put at least one of these on the wall right there, just one of these, so that way 
because I just I get really confused on when my appointments are or what task I need to get done for the day so I think if I have something that's like you know up there saying you know Monday don't forget to do this I think it'll also be cute if I have like I don't know a photo of something I just think it's cute to have nice reminders so I want to hang one of these up there on the wall All right, so I went to CVS and got some goodies. So I'm gonna make some coffee and then I'm gonna start working. Um, sorry if the lighting is horrible. Let me turn on some lights, actually. There we go. <laughs> to make it a little bit better. Ah, this is even worse. I hate it. I hate it. Let's see. I did it over here stocked up on one two <laughs> oh, three fall vibes up in here so yeah these are the pumpkin spice pumpkin pie spice delight creamers so these are about to be a bop for I don't know like I don't know how fast I run out of these creamers but let me tell you for sure it is definitely not gonna be 63 servings you know it's, it's just it's not realistic but anyways I love these And then I got the pumpkin spice. Um, oh my gosh, no. <laughs> the Pike Place medium roast. Two of these at uh, CVS. They were on sale. I'm actually not, I would rather prefer to go because I've had my own personal experience with Starbucks. I used to be a shift supervisor there. So I would honestly rather get anything else. But this was on sale, so, you know, it's cheaper. I'd like to first and foremost say that I am 100% appreciative that I'm able to have a job where I don't actually have to physically go in. Now I do work for, like I have a private client because I am like a CNA, caregiver, whatever you want to call me. So I do still work with him from my caregiving days, but that's only one client that I work with on Sunday or on Sundays. But generally speaking, this is my Monday through Friday job and I've been wanting to find a work at home job for, for years really. And so I try not to complain about my job a lot. I still do, but I really do make it an effort to not complain too much because sometimes it's really hard to come across or sometimes it's very like, you know, there's a lot of competitors out there. So when I'm frustrated, which I have been these past, like not even a few weeks, months, I try to resort back to that mindset of being grateful and appreciative. It is my 15 minute lunch. So I'm probably in my 15 minute lunch. No, it is my 15 minute break. My lunch is usually because I work Midwest time. So my lunch. Oh, and I definitely I, I had to go in the shower because I was hot and I was like, I didn't shower. So if I have been talking about this neon sign, it's only because I'm really happy and I'm excited for it. So it's going to say if I haven't already told you and I apologize if I have already, um, it's going to say build the life you love and it's going to come with 
different like a remote where I could change the colors it's gonna look really dope Ugh, love it and then let's just turn this on because it is Halloween vibes whoops let's turn it on for me over here okay um let's do actually how do I turn this on oh dumb me okay Woo! <laughs> I'm scared that Ollie's gonna mess with it though because it lights up so I don't know hopefully he doesn't so we got our little witch book over here it's cute <laughs> nothing in here I thought there was something in there for a second. Look what they did. Look what they did, guys. I got money back from Uber Eats. So they gave us all rice. All of this is rice. Look. Rice. Rice. Rice 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 they went and said they were like instead of giving them the sides because we're out whatever we're just gonna throw this shit in the bag and call it a day they didn't even give us our drinks all right this is my lunch um i'm pretty much sure my 15 minute break is pretty much over but I hate working Midwest time because one of the problems with working Midwest is that my lunch is at like one o'clock, two o'clock sometimes, depending on the day. Oh, I have two minutes left of my 15 minute break. Everybody trying to make some Jersey club, but ain't hit Jersey once. Hold up, where you from? Yeah, it's different when I do. I just got, I received a fruit cup. I received chocolate covered fruits. I received a fruit cup. I'm so ooh, ooh. But I don't have, I do have another vase. Hold on. Okay, so here's the dilemma. They are these. One has a bigger hole than the other. I don't know. I guess I could put them. Okay, we'll try it. I'm just so glad that I'm on my lunch because basically what happened is I got in trouble yesterday because I took too many days off. Look, I was, I have a lot of thyroid problems going on right now. I wasn't feeling well, but like, it's one of those things where you work for a healthcare company and they're like, we get you as long as you have that accommodation form, but then it turns out it's our policy. You can't miss this many days, yada, yada, yada. Anyways, I'm feeling actually a little bit better because I'm on some new medication. So, <clears throat> you know, I'm feeling good. I'm really feeling good. Um, Usually, no lie, Dave does this because I'm scared I'm going to injure myself. Um, I don't want to prick myself. I just know I'm going to prick myself. Uh, that's too tall. So let's do that. Let's do that. Kind of. Let me see. For this. Cute, right? Okay, that's kind of cute. I can do that length. I'm going to a Beyonce concert. I have been recently listening to the Renaissance album to kind of get accustomed to, you know, what's what she's going to be playing. Um, this is cute, right? This is so cute. It reminds me of one of those fake plants from TJ Maxx. I've been listening to all... Ugh. I've been listening to all of Beyonce's new songs. And it sounds pretty good. I hope she does some of her old songs and not just, you know, like it doesn't have to be an era's tour even though we love Taylor Swift over here. But I think that looks all right. Should I get rid of the grass? I think I should get rid of the grass. Okay, I think it looks really good. <laughs> I love it, I love it. I did kind of stuff the flowers in there, so I don't know. I don't know how long it's gonna last however it looks beautiful right now I really just couldn't throw away the white flowers because I receive flowers a lot and you know what 
I've never in a relationship received flowers. So the fact that <laughs> I'm receiving flowers, and it's not like I was like, oh my gosh, um, like, babe, buy me flowers. Like, no, Dave just buys me flowers and I love it. And every single time he does, I am so grateful. Okay, so the reason why I call this a vlog podcast or vlog cast is because I thought it would be really fun to, during this time, you know, share like a little funny story because, you know, I like to watch podcasts or listen to podcasts, listen to vlogs, watch vlogs while I'm working from home. So I thought, you know, why the hell not? And I just have a really quick short story that I thought was really annoying. So if you don't know, I'm black, Dave is white. We went to Maine for just a one day or two day getaway. We live in the East Coast, so it's very easy to do that. And we went to Portland, Maine. We went on Commercial Street. We shopped. We bought a lot of merch. And so we walk into this Maine shop and, you know, to buy a bunch of clothes. Mind you, I was spending like, I spent like $300 in that store, right? And as... The lady is checking us out. She sees my shirt and she's like, oh, well, were you even born? Did you even see them in concert? And I didn't really know what to say because she was already eyeing us. Like if you are in a, in a racial relationship, you can definitely tell when, you know, you're getting judged. You just kind of ignore it. Right. So I wasn't quick on my feet. But Dave immediately was like, Oh, well, I saw it. They came because Dave's a veteran. So when he was in the army, they were able to go to a concert. And so and then I go and my mom saw it kind of like, you know, telling her, well, you're old. And I, and I don't mean to old shame, but she was being rude. So I was like, what can I do? That's starky. That's a good comeback or whatever. And then as she's folding and when she doesn't like stop when Dave talks, but when I do, she has these glasses on and then she just nills it. You know, when someone bends down and their glasses is on their nose, but then their eyes are looking at you while their glasses is on their nose. That's what she did to me. And then she rolled her eyes and was like, yeah, I saw it too. Um, and whatever date of the year that she saw it in, but I thought it was really funny because she tried to be cute, try to be snarky. Like, what am I doing wearing that shirt? What am I doing dating a white guy? Like, it was the stare for me. Honestly, it was the stare. So it was dumb too, because I also felt like she was like, oh, she's spending this much in our store because a lot of people just brought like one or two items. And I don't know, I just felt like she was judgy from the jump, was very like, didn't like the fact that it's weird to me. I don't think she obviously owned the store. I think she was just an employee of the store. But I was getting the vibes, the energy that she was ha a hater. She was hating that I was buying this. She was hating that I was dating a white guy. She, I felt like she was the more I look back on that conversation and reset it in my head, the more I'm like, I think she was a hater. You never can be 100% sure, but because yeah, I don't want to sound all cocky, but yeah, the girl was a hater or the lady was a hater. So it is definitely like seven or no, maybe eight o'clock or something like that. Um, honestly, guys, I was so tired. I got off work, <sighs> slept. I just, it was a lot. Like, my supervisor yesterday, she was like, oh, hey, we have goals, right? And so the goals is that I want to be a supervisor. And um, I'm trying to fix the light. <laughs> Always lighting problems over here. So the goal is that I want, sorry, Dave is currently live streaming so it's it's usually extremely severely loud he has a shore mic so he doesn't really need to yell this loud but we love him anyways so we have goals at our job and mine was like oh i want to be a supervisor literally the next day this is like corporate america for you 
I don't think it's me showing my supervisor what I can do. I think she was like, oh, I... Do you hear Dave? Do you hear him? He's having a great time. A really great time. Anyways, long story short. Um, she was like, hey, train this guy in your department today. And it was just like such an easy ask, but it was so much involved and in, like into training someone one person and i work from home so it's not like you know the dude is like right next to me so it was even 10 times harder and mind you i think i did a good job i think he obviously knows the material he felt very confident by the end of the day that he could do the job he was actually doing it on his own but it was just a lot because i'm still also expected to do my task to do you know I have a certain amount of tasks I have to complete per day so I did not do that and I'm probably gonna hear about it from next week because that's usually how it works so you know it's just stress and then for the next I don't know God knows how long we are gonna have mandatory overtime starting next week mandatory overtime so I it's it's I'm stressed but Shy. Remember that, um, like on the news, it's 10 p.m. Do you know where your children are? Right. <laughs> what the fuck was the point of this? So Dave and I almost got into an argument. Uh-oh. <laughs> or we f almost fought or argued. I don't know. It was a weird moment. It weird, was a weird, weird, weird moment. Weird, weird moment. Mainly because I'm stupid, but that is what it is. I mean, if you want to call yourself stupid. Well. I don't have, like, a bra on, so I'm trying to be, like. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's just a weird moment. Yeah, it was a weird moment, not an argument. You know what? Honestly, I'm not, I don't even think I'm just saying that. Because when I really look at it, it was. It was just a weird moment. Because um, call it a miscommunication in some ways. But I guess I was a misread and sometimes just things happen. Do you want to know fire? what the weird moment was? <laughs> well, I guess we're going down that path now. So. No, I mean <laughs> oh, to the people the who are watching. Yeah, the one, the one, the that's one person <laughs> that's going to watch this. <laughs> it might be me. They're like, yes, we want to know. It's because, oh, let me get it. Hold on. Oh, we're getting props? For no, I'm just showing. So. Oh, so yeah, we the plan was, now I work. I work from uh, about 9.30 till 6 today. Blossom works uh, from 10 to 6.30. And we, uh, we're we going to go to Walgreens after to get some pictures for these frames. So, you know, I'm pretty tired from work, whatever. I just gotten off. We're, I come lay down. <laughs> I may have ripped up the medicinal cannabis. Uh, and I go lay down and relax and we're talking. And we're going to go to Walgreens, and then? I was like, oh, okay, we, we should go to Walgreens. Because I was talking to my mom um, until like 7, and then he had the live show at 8. At eight. And so... Um, it was like 7, 7, 7 or 1. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. It's not that. Anyways, it was so 7 o'clock. I, I, I asked, do you think we have enough time? Do we think, do you, and I asked And then it twice. I said, and so he asked, and I was like, yeah, it's only seven. Yeah. But, you know, and then he says it again. Do you I think did. we have enough time? And I'm like, I yeah. Did. Yeah, I, I wasn't intending to not go. There was never an intent to. So when she's like, I don't want to go, I'm instantly like, well, no, I want to go. I did not want to go. That was not my intent. So I felt bad for not going. So a little bit of overcourse correction. And uh, one thing I've learned about Blossom. When she digs in, she digs in. And when she's made up her mind, she's made up her mind. I'll say it like oh, that. Oh, yeah. I don't, I don't want it to, be, to sound like mean or anything. She just, when Blossom makes up her mind about something, she if she says it, 
She does it. She doesn't like to... She's not somebody... You're not somebody who likes to say something and not follow through. If you say it, you typically like to do it. Okay, yeah. I think that's fair. You, you say that. But it wasn't <laughs> because I was mad at him. And I took it that I way. immediately was like... All of a sudden, I was like, you know what? You know, F it, whatever. I'm tired. It was a long day at work, whatever. And all of a sudden, instantly, the thought of just staying here and not going anywhere... I give you just Uber Eats food. And I didn't pick up that. I didn't pick that up at all. I just took it. It was like, man, I messed this whole night up and I felt like a dick. So that was it. That was it. Yeah. And now we got food. Yeah. I did I did my show. I wasn't going to do my show and then I ended up doing my show. I had a good show. You, what did you do? <laughs> <laughs> you were supposed to order food. What did you, what did you I do? I ordered food and... Do you want to tell me what we got? We, I, don't, I don't know what you ordered yet. Do you want to tell them? We went time. Oh, nice. Okay, yeah. good. Look at food. Um, I watch TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what I did. Nice. Yeah. I watch well, TikTok on Bethany, like a lot of Bethany, Bethany Frankel videos. Bethany? Not like necessarily her videos, but a lot of people are not liking her right now. So. Oh, uh, she's doing some shady stuff? What's up? Not, not really, but, you know, it's, it's whatever. It's, I don't think they care about that. She's got a Frankel. funny name. I'm halfway in already. Like, I think I've said I'm so tired so many times today. Oh, me too. But it's just the truth. But this is really fun. This has been really fun vlogging all day from literally the morning, the time I woke up this morning to now. So Thank you for letting me be a part of it. I really yeah. enjoyed this. This is a really fun journey. And uh, how awesome does this wall look? You know it does. Look how good that I never. I, I've said it already like five it's times. So, You're getting a neon sign. So okay. All right, guys. Well, with that being said, you guys have a great night. And insert the food we got. Bye. Bye. <laughs>